I think it looked pretty good. I had it kind of centered on the shed and everything yeah. a minute ago. So, is it rolling? Yeah. Okay, training inside in the winter. Okay, some tips. <laughs> Just do it. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Peddling Parents. Talking about training inside in the winter when it's not the most fun. I hate training inside. It's really hard to stay there, but it's good mental discipline. So I do it. I do it all the time. I don't mind it at all. She's better at it. <laughs> Okay, so it's fun to like include them in it, like it's a team, like they're helping me win races or helping me do well on my bike riding or helping me be healthier if I'm if they're giving me an opportunity to ride. I would say the kids are our biggest fan base. They think it's pretty cool. They like to race themselves so they kinda understand mom and dad are training. If they could fit the trainer in their bikes, they probably would. I can hear you with this ear. I can hear my movie with this ear. And I can talk. It's always good to take breaks with them if you need it. Like the other day, Eli, the youngest, he he just he was not gonna have it. I rode for 11 minutes and he was like, just fussing the whole time. And I was trying to hold him and ride and I was like, no. Just knowing to quit, knowing it's just not gonna, it's not, it's not, there's gonna be no benefit to you riding through that mental stress. With kids, Do that. just enjoy it with them. Make it part of their day together instead of just me alone time. It's easier when I let them do something fun. Like, Play-Doh is always fun. It's always been a favorite. She normally does her riding when I'm gone at work, so she's kind of got that system down with the kids. We painted the other day. Painted, painted pictures? Yeah. Or the kids painted. The walls. <laughs> the table. Mostly yeah. the table. Dinner time on training nights for you is kind of tough. You, you don't want to eat too much, but you're usually hungry when you get home. Yeah, I'll normally eat just a little bit, do my ride, and then eat a full dinner after that. Um. Get a good fan, because it's really hot when you don't have air moving over you. When I'm home riding, that's kind of a special time they can sit down and maybe watch a movie or something. Makes it a little easier, but we're still kind of together. The volume goes way up because the trainer's <laughs> pretty loud. I ride the rollers on this bike and I don't have smooth tires on it, so 
it gets pretty loud. <laughs> Especially if you're doing hits or something like that. Yeah. Bailey very often walks up to the TV and <laughs> does this because she's trying to hear it. Winter riding with kids, you just kind of have to be flexible. Training inside. For sure. It's a great time to do strength training rather than be on the bike. I kind of named it the other season in my head this year instead of the off season. Because then I can just not stress out so much about being on the trainer but do fun strength training stuff and kettlebell workouts. And, and that's always fun with the kids. Yeah. You can use your kids as weights. Um, they don't have any problem crawling on you, so you might as well use them. Okay, push the red button. I still have to eat my sandwich. <laughs> Okay, ready? This is a new move. I don't know this one very well. So yeah, making it happen. You gotta, it takes effort, but you can kind of make it a family effort, get the kids on board. But yeah, lots of stuff coming up. Winter's tough, hang in there. Ride when you can, where you can, and have fun with it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm going to read a book now. Check the script. <laughs>